Nothing built can last forever, and every legend, no matter how great, fades with time. With each passing year, more and more details are lost, until all that remains are myths, half-truths. To put it simply, lies. And yet, in all the known universe, between here and the Far Lands, the legend of the Order of the Stone endures, unabridged as self-evident fact. Indeed, it is only a troubled land that has need for heroes, and ours was fortunate to have, so long ago, four heroes such as these. Gabriel the Warrior, before whose sword all combatants would tremble. Eligard, the redstone engineer, whose machines would spark an era of invention. Magnus the Rogue, who would channel his destructive creativity for the benefit of all. And Zorin, the architect, builder of worlds, and leader of the Order of the Stone. These four friends together would give so much to gain their rightful place as four heroes. Their greatest quest would take them on a dangerous journey to fight a mysterious creature known as the Ender Dragon. In the end, the Order of the Stone emerged victorious and the dragon was defeated. Their story complete, they slipped away into the pages of legend. But when one story ends, another one begins. Would you rather fight a hundred chicken-sized zombies or ten zombie-sized chickens? Yeah. Just to be clear, you wouldn't have any weapons yeah. or armor, so you'd have to fight them with your hands. I'd have to go with the giant chickens, not because I want to or because I think it would be easy, but because they would be an abomination. Imagine their giant feet. Like I said, an abomination. So, I've got a daylight sensor on the roof. Mm -hmm. And if I did this right, these lamps should turn on once it gets dark. Mm -hmm. I didn't want to just leave Reuben here with nothing while we're at the building competition. He's coming with us. Really? <laughs> What kind of question is that? Of course he is. Okay, I'm not saying he shouldn't come. I'm not. But don't you think it's a little weird that you take him with you everywhere you go? He kind of makes us look like, I don't know, amateurs. It's not weird at all. Reuben is the best pet I could ask for. Obedient, loyal, and always happy to see me at the end of a long day. No friend. I should have said friend, not pet. I didn't mean anything by it. I'm glad he's coming. I just don't want to give people one more reason to call us losers. I'm getting tired of it. I'm tired of being a laughing stock. Embrace being a loser, Olivia. And if you do that, you can be whatever you want to be. What if I want to be a winner? Well, no, accept that. Anything else, though? <laughs> All right. Fine. Did you hear that? No. Boom! <laughs> 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 oh, man. You guys totally freaked out. That was on. <laughs> Axel, what's the matter with you? Great. Now I'm going to smell like a pig in Endercon. That's what you get, Axel. I brought you good times and now I'm being punished for it? You scared us half to death. Nothing is fun if you're not scared half to death. Did you bring the fireworks? Of course I did. I even brought something for the little guy. Nice. You brought Reuben a disguise? Um, we're going to a convention. Somebody's got to wear a costume. He looks awesome. It only took me like a million hours to build it. All right, all right. You definitely brought the fireworks, right? Yes, I'm ready. I'm waiting on you guys. Hurry up and grab your stuff. We'll meet you downstairs, okay? Okay. Shears definitely taking these. Never know when I might need to shear some sheep. Give me a dragon roar, Reuben. 
That'll do, Ruben. That'll do. Gabriel the Warrior. You think we'll ever get that famous? It's not impossible. Maybe I'll get famous for my sweet poster collection. One of these days, we're gonna win the Endercon building competition. And when we do, people will look at us and say, hey, there goes Jesse and Ruben, winners of the Endercon building competition. You really should change the name. Hmm, flint and steel, not too shabby. That's everything. Let's roll. Yeah, dude. Roll. Let's go. I heard a pretty juicy rumor about the building. competition but you guys have to promise not to say anything okay also it's in two parts each part more exciting than the last spit it out axel part one the special guest at this year's intercon is none other than gabriel the warrior him freaking self whoa what's part two part two according to my sources the winner of the building competition is going to get to meet him it doesn't mean anything if we lose but if we win oh man this would make up for all the losing. I wish they were all gonna be there. Does nothing please you? You have to meet all the members of the super secret, super legendary Order of the Stone? I wasn't saying it wasn't cool. I was just saying that would be cool, too. So, does this source of yours make posters for a living? Huh? <laughs> Yeah, my, uh, source, uh, doesn't exist. You guys are my only friends. Guys, let's stay focused. We have a competition to win. We never win. And this year, we've got Ruben oh. with us. We basically have no chance. Anything can happen, Olivia. Then why have we lost nine of these in a row? You can't, no, you can't look at this as a whole. The odds are refreshed each time. Maybe no one else will show up. Now you're being realistic. <laughs> wait a minute, wait a minute. We're thinking about this all wrong. The point of the building competition isn't just to build something. We have to do something to get noticed by the judges. Okay then, so how do we do this? We don't just build something functional. We build something fun. After we finish the fireworks machine like we planned, then we build something cool on top of it. We might be onto something. If we want to get a reaction out of the judges, you build something scary. So I say we build a creeper. Wouldn't an Enderman be better? I'm more scared of Endermen than creepers. They both have their moments. They're both pretty scary. Then again, you scared the crap out of us with a creeper today. All right, let's build the creeper. You're going with Axel's idea? What's wrong with my idea? Nothing. It could be totally cool. It is cool. Yeah. I think this is the first time we've decided on something before getting to the competition. Think we've got everything we need? It wouldn't hurt to grab a little more. Let's get to grabbing then. We're so prepared, we can't lose, cannot. Bring it in. <laughs> Dare to prepare on three. No, 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 no. Preparing is 
Derek. No, that's that's the same thing. Forget it. Uh, team on three. One, two, three. Team. team. <laughs> know what we're building, we've got all the stuff for it, we are so ready. This year, it's going to be different. I'm not just ready to build, I'm ready to win. Nice pig, losers. Oh, mm. oh great. There's Lucas and the Ocelots. The rivalry continues. Man, they've got matching leather jackets and everything. So cool. Well, well, well. If it isn't the order of the losers. <laughs> Great. <laughs> the fail squad's here. Lucas, get a load of these losers. Let's go, guys. Name, please? Axel. And uh, how do you do? No, your team name. Team name? We are not ready for this. <laughs> so much for losing anonymously. We're the Order of the Pig. <laughs> really? Is it meant to tie us to Reuben, or are you making fun of me? Okay, Order of the Pig. You guys are in booth five. Ah! Ah! That right there is a limited edition. Hmm. Nope. I don't like the look of this. Freaking beacon? Freaking beacon? That's stained glass. They aren't just building a beacon. They're building a rainbow beacon. We're gonna lose. Oh, a beacon sounds awesome. Almost as awesome as us, am I right, guys? I have no idea how we're gonna beat that. Don't leave me hanging. This might be too much for us to handle. We should probably stop staring at them. Ha ha ha! Look, it's the Order of the Losers, again. <laughs> Good one, Gil. We're just looking. There'll be plenty of time for you all to look at it after... It wins and gets shown at Endercon. 
You're being unpleasant. Maybe not all of you. Endercon doesn't allow outside food or drink. I'm talking about your pig. Reuben is not food. Could have fooled me. He looks delicious. That sounded like a weird compliment. You'll have to eat me first. Uh, let's hope it doesn't come to that. Stop wasting your time, Aiden. We've got work to do. You're lucky I'm busy. Hey, Jesse. Guys. Hey, Petra. How's the bill going? Only time will tell, but we're optimistic. Hey, Petra. I forgot to thank you for that nether star. Hey, Lucas. Not a problem. You help these tools? For the right price, I'll help anyone. If you need anything, you know where to find me. None of us know where to find you. Exactly. No hard feelings, guys. If you're cool with Petra, you're cool with us. So why don't we just forget about all this and, you know, make this about how cool our builds are? We're going to crush you. <laughs> I don't know if you know this, but we're pretty good. Oh, wait. I get it. It's like a joke, right? No, I'm serious. We're going to destroy you. <laughs> you know, you're really funny. That's awesome. Hey, good luck. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome to the Endercon Building Competition! The winners of this year's competition will have their build featured at Endercon. The winners will also meet, in person, Gabriel the Warrior! Ocelot! 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 Whoa, handshake? We don't have a handshake. We'll just make one up. We'll call it the... Uh... The Griefer Grab! Hmm. And just like that, I'm nervous again. Don't talk like that. We can do this. Just stick to the plan and everything will be fine. This year, the Order of the Pig can't lose. Let's do it. Building starts now. Oh no, a fireworks dispenser. I'm so scared. You worry <laughs> about your build, and we'll worry about ours. Now, the moment of truth. Here goes nothing. Oh man, that looks so cool. We'll win this for sure. The creeper was definitely the right way to go. Guys, people are looking at us. Good build, man! What? No way. Just a bunch of dyed wolves. Whoops. Oh no, Ruben's on fire! Ruben, no, come back! It was Aiden, that punk. The lava's getting closer. You're gonna ruin the build. Ruben's going to get lost. We've got to do something. We've got to get Ruben. Ah! Oof. We're right behind you. Ah. Ah. I don't see him anywhere, Reuben. The sun's going down. We gotta find him fast. He could have gone anywhere, and this part of the woods is huge. We stand a better chance of finding him if we split up. If either of you get lost, just use the lights from Endercon to make your way back to town. Got it? Got it. Ruben? Where are you? Just give me an oink if you can hear me. Hmm. 
Hmm, pig tracks. Run by here. Doesn't look like this fire will spread. <sighs> I bet Reuben started this. Just oink if you can hear me. I hear some. Reuben, are you in there? Pigs but Reuben, shut up! Yeah. <laughs> Reuben, it's getting scary out here! Are you in there, buddy? Oh, jeez, please don't be toasted, Reuben. Get out of here, Reuben. Hope you're ready for some more walking. We gotta hurry back to town if we don't want to run into... I 
know it's bad. I'll think of something. <sighs> Too many of them, buddy. Don't leave that spot, no matter what. You hear me? <laughs> I've got you. <laughs> Get away from him! <laughs> oh no, he got you! <laughs> Get off me! Come on, let's get out of the open. I want to show you something. Not that this isn't a really cool, dimly lit tunnel, but how far away is this thing you want to show me? Careful, Jesse. You don't want to get a reputation as a wimp. Y y this isn't my first time in a cave, Petra. Yeah, but have you ever seen a wither skull? Whoa! Fresh from the nether. You're the first person I've showed it to. So, you'd better appreciate this. You risk your life for that dusty old skull? No, oh, I risk my life for the thing I'm gonna exchange for that dusty old skull. There's this guy I'm meeting up with at Endercon. He's gonna trade me a diamond for it. Being the resident go-getter pays off every once in a while. Is a wither skull worth that much? <laughs> Are you kidding? For all the trouble I had to go to get it, I should be asking for much more. Wow. Wow what? In a single day, you went to the nether, you killed a wither skeleton. I mean, I did build a super cool statue, but still, it's pretty sweet being you, huh? You know, you could come with me. I mean, if you're too nervous, I totally get it. But I wouldn't mind a little backup. I'd be honored to be your backup. You don't have to make such a big deal out of it. I just said... You could come with me. I know. I was there. It was amazing. Kind of starting to have second thoughts here. You just keep a crafting table down here? Comes in handy. Since that wooden sword of yours got busted... You're giving me a new one? Even better. You can make your own. One stick plus two stones equals one sword. Just grab what you need. Oh, okay. Thanks. Hey, is all this stuff yours? No. We're just stealing from whoever was dumb enough to leave us here. Of course it's mine. Just making sure. Oh, here we go. Jack... Just place the pieces on the table. Isn't it better when you make it yourself? <laughs> Check it out. Endercon's all lit up. Oh man, looks like Lucas and his ocelots won again. Sorry, Jesse. But you've got to admit, that beacon does look pretty sweet. Yeah, yeah. I just wanted this to be the year we finally beat that jerk. You know, Lucas may be kind of arrogant, but he has come through for me in tricky situations. You might want to get to know him. Just in case. He's good at building, that's for sure. It's always useful to have a guy like that around. No matter what you might think of him personally. Yeah, you might be right. I'm just saying, if you run into him at Endercon, try talking to him. I don't need a lecture on the power of collaboration, Petra. But a lecture on the power of my fists is short, but deadly. Come on, let's hurry. Remember what Endercon was like before it was cool? Remember what we were like before we were cool? Some of us will never be cool. Ha ha. <laughs> Creepers! <sighs> Uh, 
This doesn't look good. Well, there's only one way off this bridge. Whatever we do, we do it together. Uh All right, let's jump. You know, you dive into the water. You don't land on top of it. Pull yourself together and follow me. 